consider the wave represented by the below sinoid graph. So here we have a sinoid graph, okay, and it's not on here, but here we know that this is displacement and this is time, okay. And the question is, what is the amplitude of this wave? Remember, amplitude is the maximum displacement that it has. It starts here, and over time, the maximum displacement is when it's there or there, but that, in terms of distance, is 7. Okay, so let's write it as 7, and we don't know the units, uh, if it's meters, but let's write 7 meters. Okay. What is the period of this wave? So remember the period is the timing between when we start the wave until when we start the next wave. There we start the next wave. So this looks like every each one is 0. Point, if that's half of that, that should be 0 0.06, 0 0.012, 0 0.018, 0 0.024. Uh, okay, so this this thing can be, if I divide it again in half, that would be 0.3. Okay, so this is slightly more than 0 0.036. Slightly more. I'm going to go for 0, 0, 0.04. Okay, I think that that might be more or less correct. Slightly more than 0 0.03. And... Um, no, let's leave it at that. What is the frequency of the wave? What is the frequency of the wave? Remember, the frequency is 1 over the period. Frequency is 1 over t. Okay, and that means 0 over, it's not 0, 1 over 0, 0,04. Okay, and what is that going to be? Uh, four, 4 would have been 0 0.25 okay so 0 0.4 would be 2.5 so 0 0.04 should be 25 okay 25 Hertz okay next if the velocity of the wave is 347.06 meters per second what is the wavelength of this wave so in order to calculate wavelength, we do need velocity because velocity is equal to wavelength times frequency, or we could go wavelength divided by period. Okay, so velocity is equal to, oh, we have velocity is 347,06 is equal to lambda. Uh, this is the wavelength we're trying to calculate, and I'm going to use frequency. It's such a nice number, 25. Okay, and then lambda is 347,06 divided by 25. What do we get when we do that? Okay, is 347.06 times, no, divided by 25 gives me 13.88 meters per second is equal to 13,88 not meters per second meters okay lambda is the wavelength so that is how long it is and it's 13.88 meters